Did you know that in Camtasia 2022, there's an effect that can do this? Hi, I'm Ken with Learning Zen. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to use the outline edges effect in Camtasia 2022. Hey, thanks for watching. You know, when I first saw this effect, it immediately took me back to my senior year in high school, 1986. Apparently, our high school didn't even have color back then. Uh, but it reminded me of the AHA video, Take On Me. And if you haven't checked out the AHA video, Take On Me, you can check that out right here. And at the time, it was just mind-blowing. Like, how are they doing this? Are they just doing stop animation? Are they just flipping through someone's uh, sketchbook? So today, we're going to go through how you can get a similar effect using the outline edges effect in Camtasia. So the first thing you'll do inside Camtasia 2022 is take your media from your media bin, pull it down onto your timeline. I'm just going to resize everything here. And then to access the effect, you're going to go to the left on your tool menu and you're going to select visual effects. Now, if you do not see visual effects, click more and visual effects will be located there. Select visual effects. And the visual effect that we're looking for is called outline edges. You'll just grab that, drag it down onto your media on your timeline. And there you have it. It changes the image or video, or it even works on text. And it gives it kind of a sketch feel or a drawing feel. Now, when you first put the effect on the piece of media, if you look to the right on the properties panel, by default, the intensity is at 100 and the desaturate is at 100 as well. If you decrease the intensity, it increases the clarity of the image. And if you decrease the desaturate, it allows more color to come through. So you can play with these and, and adjust these as you need and get some really, really interesting effects. So that is your outline edges in Camtasia 2022. Now, why would I use this? How would I use this? Well, for example, maybe just another way to visually represent a time lapse. So we could take this back up to 100. I could say this was a concept or an idea, so I kind of sketched it out. And then I can go again to the left on my tool menu, click animations, and then select the animations category, grab the custom, pull it down onto my timeline, adjust it a little bit here. And before we're going to be at 100, and at the end, I'm going to take it to zero. So you could use this to visually represent something coming into focus or going from the beginning stages to the end stages, and it just kind of fades through. And there we go, the final product. So just one example of how you can use the effect as well. Uh, you can use it on video. If you're an e-learning uh, like myself, I've used this effect for titles. Uh, it gives a really neat effect as the title is like the drawing, and then you can kind of fade it into the actual color once you get into the actual presentation or your actual video. So it just gives a little break up something a little different. There it is. How to use the outline edges effect in Camtasia. If you've used the outline edges effect or have an idea of how to use it, go ahead and drop it in the comments. I'd love to read and find out how other people are using it. And remember, if you like this video, give us a like, hit that subscribe button and the notification bell, 
and we'll be coming out with new videos every week. Until next time, remember, laugh more and learn more. See ya.